The Glad Products Company is an American company specializing in trash bags and plastic food storage containers. Topic history The Glad brand originated in the United States in 1963 when the owner and CEO of the company, David Darrick, launched Glad Wrap, a polyethylene film used as a food wrap. Douglas G. Taylor was transferred that same year from the Union Carbide facility in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania to spearhead the Glad project. Mr. Taylor headed sales and marketing for the Glad products until he was retired from Union Carbide in 1985 after putting together the sale to First Brands. At the time of the sale, Mr. Taylor was senior VP of the Home and Automotive Products Division as well as the head of STP Brands. Douglas G. Taylor died in Hilton Head, South Carolina. August 13, 1996. The brand originally belonged to Union Carbide, but was divested in 1985 to First Brands Corporation Everetti and Energizer Batteries, Glad, Simon Is, and Preston in the United States. In 1998, First Brands was acquired by Clorox. In 2002, Clorox allowed Procter & Gamble to buy a 10% share in Glad Products Company, thus making it a joint venture. Three years later, P&G exercised its option under the agreement to increase its ownership to 20%, the maximum allowed under the joint venture agreement. Topic. Australian history Glad Wrap was invented in Australia by Union Carbide's research chemist, Douglas Lyons Ford, in the early 1960s, working in Union Carbide Australia's Rhodes plant in Sydney. The film was made from polyethylene with a stickifier added, produced as a continuous tube by the blown film method, the tube then slit to make flat material that was put on rolls, and recently released in a newly designed, easy cut dispenser. It was first introduced to the American market in 1963 in competition with Saran Wrap. Glad Wrap and Glad Bags were introduced in Australia in 1966. Glad was the first to introduce cling type wrap to the Australian market. In order to promote the product, a competition was run in the Australian Women's Weekly asking readers to write in with suggested uses for the product. The winner of the competition was Lady Gwyneth Casey, the wife of Lord Casey, the then Governor General of Australia, who suggested it could be used to cover the hors d'oeuvre before guests arrived at her garden party. Second prize went to a woman from Western Sydney, who suggested it could be used to wrap up different kinds of buttons in her sewing kit to keep them separate from one another. Union Carbide purchased the Brisbane company, OSO, and in 1968, launched the OSO brand in competition with its own Glad brand. The OSO brand was made to be cheaper than, and inferior to, the Glad brand. In Australia, the Glad brand was acquired by Industrial Equity Limited in 1988, and then was floated as part of National Foods in 1991. In 1997, First Brands acquired the Glad brand from National Foods, thus consolidating worldwide ownership of the brand. Clorox took over ownership of Glad in Australia in 1998 as part of its acquisition of First Brands. Topic. The Man from Glad The Man from Glad is the Glad Company's spokesman featured in many of their advertisements. He is an older gentleman with white hair and is always dressed in a white suit. In the 1960s, he was known as the Man from Glad and was summoned to various households in order to save housewives from their domestically challenged spouses. He wore a trench coat and would arrive in a wild variety of spy type contraptions, such as a jetpack or gyroglider, in the style of the man from UNCLE and Mission Impossible. He has been portrayed by several actors over the years, most famously Tom Bosley. The trash bag slogans were, Why take chances, get glad, and Don't get mad, get glad. Topic. Mardi Gras 2006 In 2006, following Hurricane Katrina, Glad became the first official sponsor of Mardi Gras in New Orleans. In addition to its significant program commitment, Glad worked with the City of New Orleans Department of Sanitation in the Carnival's sanitation maintenance and cleanup efforts, which would otherwise have mounted a considerable expense for the municipality. Glad also was a major sponsor of the 2007 Mardi Gras. Topic. Year of Glad. In the novel Infinite Jest by David Foster Wallace the final year of commercially subsidized time is referred to as the Year of Glad, in reference to the company. Additionally, James O. Incandenza Sr. whose son James O. Incandenza Jr., and grandsons Oren, Mario, and Hal Incandenza are major characters is mentioned as having played the man from Glad in his time as an actor in the timeline of the book. Topic. 
Topic. See also. Million Dollar Mystery. Topic. External links. Official website. Glad Australia's commercial website.